I'm Stuart Thompson, editor of Digital TV Europe. I'm here with Jacques-Edouard Guillemo, who's the SVP at NAGRA. Now, we're hearing a lot more about how data can help operators achieve their goals, including, for example, fighting churn and enabling customers to be more satisfied. How do you see data playing a role here and what can it achieve? You know, Stuart, the role of data for operators is really very important. We have to understand, you know, who are the competitors of operators. And the, the biggest competitors are Netflix, are Facebook, are Fortnite. And they have built their entire uh, infrastructure and business processes around data. And when we, when we look at operators, you know, they have legacy systems that for some of them have, are 30 years old, you know, and they need to get the same agility in terms of managing and knowing their subscribers. And that's where data comes in, and that's where they need to be able to manage their data in a way that allows them to be more and more sharp in the relationship they have with their customer in order to fight against competition. Now, operators obviously have access to a huge amount of data. What do they need to do to organize that and make it actually useful? Oh yeah, operators have access to a lot of data, way too much data, you know? And it's, 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 the first thing to do is to ask for an operator is to ask, what's, what's my biggest problem? What's, a, what, what's my strategic issue? You know, and starting here and then looking at which data you need to answer this question, it, it is much more important than just looking at all the data they have in order to solve the issue. So I think the, to answer straight to your question, being able to reconstruct the experience of the customer, you know, every touch point of the customer with data is very important. How does the bill look like? How does the viewing experience look like? How the recommendation look like? Is, is, it is very important to be able to reconstruct this data in order to provide a better service. Now, which departments within operators' organizations are likely to use this data? And what are some examples of actions that it can enable? Okay, there are two questions in, in one here. So first, all departments should be able to use data in a meaningful way. Okay? The biggest issue at our customers is that their organization is very siloed. You know? And how do you break those silos and how do you make data available for everyone that needs it? And so that's, uh, that's uh, you know, the BI team, the marketing team, the content purchasing team, the CEO, all need to have access to the same kind of data, but just presented in a different way. So now to the second part of your question, you know, every key area of the business needs to be covered with data. So when you purchase your content, when you acquire a new subscriber, or when you adjust your pricing, when you manage the issues of your network, when you are working on targeted advertising, all of these aspects need to, to be covered with data. So all the departments that are involved in those areas need to have access to data. Now we hear a lot about the role of artificial intelligence everywhere in media. What role can AI play in all of this? What I, what I love to say, you know, is that AI is, is, is bringing science to the art of an operator. You know, when I, have, when I have purchased content for 30 years, I know the tricks of the business, you know, and, and I have intuition and it's, 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 it's the way most of operators work, you know. Adding AI on top of that gives, a, gives, gives another point of view, you know, that is counterintuitive and that helps those experts to be more efficient. AI also allows to be very specific per subscriber, meaning putting as if there were one brain behind each subscriber to take the right decision. What is the next best package to propose? What is the optimal price to offer? What is the, the, the issue on the, the network that we experience? All this, you know, that you can do at a very granular uh, level. Now, I know your big uh, product offering in this area is Nagra Insight. Can you tell me a little bit more about that and what role it can play? Nagra Insight, you know, a lot of players in the industry start from the data and then build visualization around data. We took the exact opposite uh, point of view. We ask ourselves with our customers, what is your main business issue, you know? And then we built a, a lot of modules that answer very specific business questions, you know, like uh, how do I better price? How do I acquire, what's the price of a piece of content, etc. 
and recommend actions. You know, I think uh, for a, a perfect AI system needs to uh, recommend actions, need to help the business people to better work on a daily basis. And that's what uh, Insight provides, you know, the next best action on very diverse topic. We have about 45 different modules tailored for the industry. Uh, and uh, we, 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 and that's the way Insight works. Jack Edward, thanks very much. Thank you, Stuart.